man. I can't <laughs> wait for everyone to hear this. It's going to yeah. be amazing. Um, can't give details yet because I'm not allowed to, but pretty soon, next in July, we're going to make some um, announcements of uh, everybody involved. And yeah, it's exciting, man. It's let's just say it's my favorite corn record in the last 10 years. So. up really nice they yeah. got the, the new ones say world tour yeah. 2016 on them but they uh they're awesome man they take a pounding and they they uh can't say enough good stuff about them the durability and quality is, is you know i don't yeah. hit light in this game by any means really hard it, and Jonathan comes up to me it goes right yeah. into the vocal mic so I'm putting up a little bit softer cymbals up here not so yeah. harsh for him really. it's your ride you're obsessed yes of yeah. course 21 inch rock ride always and always my 18 inch ozone right there Bozio 16 yeah I like it yeah 14 inch I had got some bells and choppers I have this one yeah it's, too. it's great sound yeah. you know my pads over here and some bells yeah. we just try to uh, uh, Starfire head the other day yeah. on the gong base. Just see what it would sound like. It's pretty good. Yeah, Emperor X. They they take a lot of abuse because I hit really hard. So yeah. obviously the Emperor X, it's I can really smash these things and it's not gonna. They yeah. don't really break. I rarely break a snare drum. But tonight he tried some vintage Emperors on here. So I'm curious yeah. to see what these sound like. They're stretching right now. They're very high pitched. But um, always the Emperor clears on the toms. You know, they always last the best. KXM's coming out. I can't wait. I'm excited, man. We, we did the um, same kind of formula we did on the first record. Song a day. Don't overthink it. We didn't write one note. We booked the studio time. Walked in and just played. You know, write the song. Three or four hours. I'll be tracking drums for the record. The next thing you know, you know, so Doug's working on vocals right now. And it should be out towards fall. You know, I'm excited about that. two three songs that we wrote before he passed unfortunately and, and he's such an amazing guitar player i want to pay homage to him and try to put him out somehow tastefully and my friend billy sheen wants to play bass on him so that's going to be great but we're trying to you know right. he's such a virtuoso guitar player he pulls ideas out of you which is awesome you know it's a, you always want musicians to challenge you and take you to another level and, playing at uh, Megadeth and the drum tech came back and said, yeah. stop playing them. Oh. <laughs>